you have a play or an opportunity in El Dorado Gold. Take your symbol right. G O. What do you see in there? Well, and let me let me agree with you on that one point. So gold is just going up and up and up, hitting all time highs, right? Uh, I, actually, I've been looking at Bitcoin, but let me go ahead and take a look at the gold here in front of everybody. You know, it's at an all time high. Let's click on this. Uh, 2,640 is where we currently are, are trading basically on gold. So, you know, it keeps going higher and higher. But El Dorado Gold Corp is one of those mining companies. And that's a little bit different. Although, you know, they've been going up. If I go back in time about a year, you can see just like with the price of gold, they're going up as well. But I keep seeing this slight uptrend here, but I also see the sideways chop. And I think we can trade that in the short term. Now, ideally, I would like to actually get in on a long position. So that means my covering position would be either buying shares of this stock or buying, you know, back month, deep in the money call options. And so ultimately, I think that's what I'd like to do. In other words, I'd like to wait for this to pull back. And I'd like to, at the next bottom reversal, get into that. But I see a short-term trade where we could do some shorting. And the reason why I pointed this out today is because we did get a signal on Wednesday that on Thursday we should think about shorting and on Friday we should think about shorting. And the truth is, is that on Thursday and even today, we're not getting the follow through, which tells me that we still have opportunities um, coming up in the next, you know, next week to see follow through. And in other words, you haven't missed your opportunity to short some El Dorado gold. And I would short this thing and then around the $16 mark, maybe even uh, lower, um, I would look for selling some premium. And at the same time, I would double down and I would buy some of that stock. So I'd be in this position from both sides, right? But I guess for the immediate, I'm looking for follow through on my shorting signal in order to short some of this ticker. There's enough liquidity in the back end. If I didn't want to short El Dorado Gold, maybe I, I'm not into shorting. Or maybe I don't have a margin account, which allows me to short. I'm in a cash account. I could then instead get the same effect by buying something like the El Dorado Gold April 2025 $24 put. That put has a enough, it, it, it acts like the stock. And this is one of the cool things about options trading. We can create all of these substitute positions. This is a stock replacement strategy. So instead of shorting El Dorado Gold, right? Because shorting basically means if the stock goes down, you make money. If I buy this put option I just mentioned, which is the El Dorado Gold April 2025 $24 put, if I um, buy that, uh, I will also make money if it goes down. And I'll probably make money close to the same rate as if I shorted El Dorado Gold, and I'll get to buy that stock. So I really like this idea. But again, I'm thinking short duration here. I'm thinking probably, uh, you know, I could see even when I sell premium, selling premium that's in the money, you know, assuming that I would get exercised because my real play here is to go long. So I, my real play would be to look for the next bottom reversal and buy some El Dorado gold. So a short term play and the longer term play laid out for you guys. Look at El Dorado Gold.